Well, I certainly hope everyone stayed cool today. Blistering heat here in this country, as our Oh Jung Hee reported earlier. So it's summer here in full gear. Let's head straight over to our Lee Ji Hun at the Weather Center to find that out. Ji Hun, wow, um, it could have very well passed for July today. And uh, right behind you, is that simmering heat wave right behind you? <laughs> I think so. It was so hot. And as you say, the daily high in Seoul was about 31.9 degrees Celsius, marking the hottest day in May in 84 years. It was more like August than May today. Right. So um, I suppose the real question is, is it blistering heat? Is it here to stay? Uh, I would say so for at least next couple of days. And today, Gwangju in Gyeonggi-do province saw the highest temperature of 35.2 degrees Celsius, and other parts also saw daily highs soaring to above 30 degrees Celsius today. And tomorrow should be a repeat of today's conditions for much of the country, including here in Seoul, along with very strong UV levels. On that note, let's move on to tomorrow's temperature readings. Daily Low here in Seoul will start out at 17 degrees Celsius, and Busan and Jeju will wake up to 16 degrees Celsius. And as for the daily highs, Seoul will top out at 32 degrees Celsius once again, while Busan and Jeju will be slightly breezier, getting up to 25 and 23 respectively. And again, be prepared, these scorching temperatures will continue through the weekend. That's Korea for you, and here's the international weather for viewers around the world.